Lost Trades is a different kind of company. We build boats, tree houses, anything non-conventional. But we don't just build these things. We get out in the world and we put them into action and we use them to make money. What is Lost Trades? That's simple. It's the ocean, the mountains. It's expeditioning. The places that you want to be building incredible things with your hands. Over the next few minutes, we're going to describe to you a sailing catamaran that has no equal. Like the voyaging canoes of ancient Polynesia, this one is made of wood. Although there are many modern materials available, Wood and its combination with epoxy has a very high weight to strength ratio. It's also a renewable resource and can handle millions upon millions of flexings without showing stress. A conventional fiberglass and foam boat will end up in a landfill in 50 years, whereas a wooden boat properly sealed with epoxy could last anywhere from 150 to 200 years. We've worked on the building crew of five previous construction projects where we built these catamarans from scratch and we also have five years of sailing experience from the Caribbean where we operated our own 50-foot catamaran. We've done three open ocean voyages of more than a thousand miles each uh, and two of those through the Bermuda Triangle. And when you're out there hundreds of miles from anything, you really start to look at the design features and the strength of the vessel. One thing's for sure, this boat is phenomenally sturdy. Its hulls are almost an inch thick, and the joinery of the wood handles the forces of the sea in a very unique way. It basically provides a dynamic type of structural integrity that can flex in certain places and in other places it's designed to be the strength of steel. But probably the single most important thing about this boat is the fact that it's Coast Guard certified to carry passengers. Anytime you can turn a key and take 70 people on an excursion, you're talking about uh, one heck of a way to make a living. And I think only recently people are starting to look at the potential uses of a vessel like this in the context of adventure travel, a very young industry where you have thousands of people, very discerning travelers that want to reach these spectacular places and they really do care about the way that they get there. What better way to reach these spots than by sailing under 1100 square feet of canvas. But the thing that keeps us coming back is the passion to build something better than ever before.
laying down one night, I heard Papa tell Mama, I heard Papa tell Mama, Little boy Boogie. to come out.